Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Truth Be Told. I pray that you are amazing today. Man, I had a thought. I just wanted to bless you all today. But the Bible says that we are to reign as kings on earth. What does that mean? It means that we are to have dominion. He gave us dominion. Do you know what dominion means? We need to look these words up. I listen. I am so sick and tired of Christians walking around with a victim mentality because God has done his part. We need to do our part. Let me tell you what I mean. When you watch a game that you know the outcome of the game, right? Everybody understands sports analogies. You couldn't watch the game, but you know that they won. Your team won, okay? And you start to watch the game, and they start to fumble. They look like they're losing. They're behind. Do you worry? Absolutely not, because you know the outcome of the game. How is this any different, y'all? Our names are written in the book of life. Jesus died for eternal salvation. That's something nobody can take. If you truly believe that promise, then why are you not believing every other promise? Why are we walking around speaking and aligning ourselves with Satan every single day? Oh, I'm broke. Oh, I can't do this. Oh, I'm this. I'm that. It goes against what God says because God says you're fearfully and wonderfully made. That he's your provider. That means God's a liar. I'm just, listen, I'm keeping it to you real. We're not even aware. This is why God says be vigilant, be aware, be of sober mind. Because if you don't know the word, you're not going to know that you're aligning yourself with saying he says my people perish for lack of knowledge so i'm telling you what are you doing with your time that's so important that you can't get into the word tell me about it whatever it is it's a lie from the enemy he wants to keep you from the truth because the truth will get you free honey free from the bondage of your stinking thinking and allowing saying to continue to dominate your life you are supposed to dominate over sickness poverty over every situation in your life every ever circumstance in your life you are to dominate because god is giving you everything you need so let me ask you again, why are you in the situation you're in? I'm just asking. You know, I know it seems harsh, but man, we got to wake up, okay? I love each and every one of you. I pray that we start to reign as kings because it's not us, but the power. It's not I who lives, but Christ who lives in me, honey. It's the power of Jesus, the resurrection power, the blood of Jesus. There's power in the blood. There's power in the name of Jesus. Apply it in your life today, please, in the name of Jesus. I love you guys. I'm on Power Place and mm, Victory Boulevard. Where you at? Holla.